Hey, I just wanted to let you know that I saw all the stuff you've been posting on your social media about long COVID, and I just wanted to say that it really helped to open my eyes, and as a result of all that stuff, I've started taking COVID a lot more seriously, I've started wearing my mask again whenever I go in public, and I've started just avoiding really any events because I think you're right. I think it's not worth it. I think long COVID isn't worth it. And I think it's pretty smart to do anything I can to avoid letting that happen to me. More than that, I realized that it's pretty unfair for me to call myself your friend when I'm doing things that harm you. So I'm sorry that I didn't wear a mask before. I'm sorry that I didn't take COVID seriously. I'm sorry that I didn't consider that I was endangering you by not taking COVID seriously. I'm sorry that you can walk into any space and immediately see who cares about you and who doesn't. I can't imagine what that's like. I'm sorry that you don't feel safe anywhere. And I'm sorry that I was part of that. That I was part of the reason why you didn't feel safe. I'm sorry that you're constantly expected to just accept that you're nothing but collateral damage, that your life is a small price to pay for our freedom, for our convenience. I'm sorry that you have to live in a world where everyone says that to you in everything that they do. And I want you to know that if you do get COVID, or if you get long COVID, that I'll help you. I'll bring you food. I'll make sure you can pay your bills. And I'll listen to you. Even if you're just in bed. I'll come and I'll sit with you. Because I see that being able to believe that your health is about personal responsibility is a privilege that many people don't have. I'm sorry I acted in ways that made you feel unimportant and unsafe. And I'm trying to get my friends to take COVID more seriously too. Because they probably know people who are disabled and chronically ill and they don't even realize it and they're putting all those people at risk and sending the message to all those people that they don't matter and that they're disposable that their lives are less important than our convenience so thank you for explaining to me even when I didn't want to listen thank you for protecting me Thank you for educating me. Thank you for giving me the benefit of the doubt and assuming that I had good intentions, even though I was behaving selfishly.